here with me now to talk about this new app, Study Tree, and the potential of AI in education is company CEO Ethan Kaiser. Ethan, thank you for joining me today. Hi, thanks for having me on. So let's let's start with your app, Study Tree, that is geared clearly more toward, we could say, a younger generation, perhaps. Does this uh, technology, this AI, do, do they speak to the students? How does how does it actually work? Yeah, we work with institutions directly, we tie into their systems, we monitor student performance, and mostly our users are freshmen and sophomores, a lot of minority students actually, who don't have these support networks already. Our technology will actually talk to them through a, you know, a, a mobile app, and they can speak to it back or they can message it back, and we'll actually help them connect with resources on campus, help them connect with study groups. If the student falls behind in a class, it'll reach out to them and support them. And through this kind of coaching methodology, we've been able to support thousands of students without having the university the burden of hiring you know, many more coaches. So it's a way to scale academic support services at an institution for all students. Uh, let's talk a little bit about student loan debt. Now, the Federal Reserve recently reported nearly 50 million Americans owe $1.5 trillion in student loan debt. Now, that's $521 billion more than total U.S. credit card debt. Now, working in the education industry, do you think people are ignoring or underestimating how big of a crisis we're facing with these uh, student loan bubble? Well, if you actually look at how this debt is accumulated, 50% uh, of college students aren't graduating in six years. And if you actually drop out of a university, uh, you're actually much more likely to default on your student loans because you didn't get the job or the degree that you desired. Um, you don't get that career boost. So yes, there's an issue with student debt, but it's mostly around completion and graduation. Um, if students complete their degree, they're much more likely to pay off their debt. So we should be focusing on getting students to college to graduation. That's where we put our time, and that's the most effective way of actually eliminating this debt. Well, I'm glad to have uh, people like you coming up with uh, these to keep people and students in college to finish the degree that they are indebted to. Uh, CEO of Study Tree, Ethan Kaiser, thank you so much for being with me today. Yep, thanks for having me.